my mountain friends that want to become shadow hunters. I'm Crazy, and today I'm gonna help you with this. The first thing you're gonna need is a red lipstick pencil and some base, some powder base for your body. And I want to tell you something. If you notice, my runes are like in a red color. That's because on the Shadow Hunter show, the women don't use black runes like the guys do. So I want to do it, to do something different for the girls, for us girls. So if you like the look, stay tuned because I'm going to show you how to make the runes. If you notice my necklace, it's a copy of the Shadow Hunters Isabel Lightwood's necklace. Well, it's Magnus who gave it to Camille, who lost it, and then it was found, and then when it was returned to Magnus, Magnus gave it to Isabel. Because allegedly it's now a Lightwood Relky, a Lightwood family Relky. So I got mine on Amazon like in two or three dollars and with free shipping. So I'm gonna leave the link down below if you wanna go buy yourself one. It didn't take that long to arrive, like two weeks because it came from China. The only thing I'm gonna tell you is that it's not gonna have on the back of the necklace the writing in Latin that said true love never dies. But it's really cool and I don't know, I like it. Get ready for a very simple tutorial on how to turn yourself into a shadow hunter. When it rains, it pours. There will be blood in the waterfall to the floor. Big waves hung on our shoulders. This is our time, no turning back, we could live, we could live like legend. This is our time, no turning back, we could live, we could live like legend. If you like this video, remember to comment, like, share, subscribe, and I hope you try this look either for Halloween, for a party, or just for fun like I do. If you do, make sure to tag me on Instagram or Twitter because I would love to see how did your runes came out. And if you're not as much as a good drawer of you would like, you could also draw the rune, cut it, and then use a pencil to draw the line and then fill the blanks. That is also a very good way to make your runes. If you're not a good drawer and you want them to be perfect, I'm not as picky because I think that it's cool when they don't look so perfect, that imperfection is beauty, like they say. And I didn't draw as much runes on myself as when I did the photo shoot that I draw these runes on. But you can draw as much as you want. So turn it yourself into a shadow hunter. And I hope seeing you next week for the next video.